A follow-up now to a vicious dog attack three weeks ago in Norfolk. A smaller dog out for a walk on a leash was ravaged by a much bigger dog, reportedly not on a leash. Tenor News Side's Chris Horn has this update on the dog's condition and the hefty vet bills. The dog that was attacked is recovering. A witness described the attacking dog as a large, brindle-collared, mixed-breed mastiff. Ten-year-old Mercy, a Jack Russell Terrier, looking much better than he did a couple weeks ago. He was attacked by another dog in Kingsbury Road in Norfolk. This is where his hair is growing back, where he got grabbed like that. Owner Jen Williamson was facing some huge vet bills. Close to seven and a half thousand dollars. But the other family's all-state insurance is covering the medical costs for Mercy. Williamson had raised nearly $1,000 from a GoFundMe account. She's paying that forward as donations to three agencies, including $500 here to Currituck Animal Shelters. Here you go on behalf of Thank Mercy. Thank you. We appreciate yeah, that. Sure. Yeah. Thank you. No problem. The manager says she'll use the money for enrichment toys, treats, and other items for the facility where Williamson originally adopted Mercy. We can go purchase things that we need right now. We are a county-run facility, so we do have a budget. Williamson says she hasn't heard much from Norfolk Animal Authorities about the progress of the investigation. It could have gone even worse. Like I said, our neighborhood, we got a lot of children in there that walk their dogs. But she's happy to see that Mercy's on the mend. I think everybody will turn out good. No, oh, oh, what, what? Norfolk authorities say their investigation of the dog attack is ongoing. Chris Horn, 10 in your side.